Check it out, guys. It's Trevor James. We are bright and early at the Nagumbo Lagoon, and today is a super special occasion because we are going to be having a full-on crab adventure. Let's check it out. Get ready for some of the most delicious crabs you'll ever see. Because today, we're going in deep and super local for some of the best crabs in Sri Lanka. Bringing you to eat at four different locations to try different crabs with us. All cooked different styles and all super delicious. You're going to love this video. So make sure to watch all the way until the end to enjoy all of these delicious crabs with us. Let's eat. So the plan today, guys, is we're going to eat a bunch of crabs starting first here at the seafood market we're going to take a look here and then go to the lagoon and pick up a giant hopefully a good sized lagoon crab let's see what we got here first though tuna tuna tuna, tuna. oh big chunks of tuna look at these tuna 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 baby tuna baby tuna oh look at these wow big prawn colorful Good. Very tasty. Lagoon. Oh, lagoon prawn. And on our way to the mud crab nest area, we got invited by a local fisherman to hold his fishing rod. Why not? And this is just such a beautiful location here, bright and early. All the fishing boats. It's truly stunning. Looking for para. Para, para. Para, para. <laughs> oh, down here in the bag. Oh, so this is the para. Oh, wow, and what a beautiful scene this is. So many fishermen here fishing for para fish, and we are going to make our way to the lagoon and try and get a big, plump mud crab. Let's check it out. Awesome, guys, and we just made our way to a little neighborhood outside of the fish market, and we're going to a local mud crab nest. This is going to be amazing. We're bringing these mud crabs to the nest where they feed them, get them nice and plump, and then sell them. And it's just right here. Every house here has their own nest. So we got lucky today. We've got a local family that's bringing us to their own nest, and we can see how it's done. This is it. We are at the nest. The mud crab nest. Oh, and here they are. Look at these. You can see mud crab. They actually just live right in the mud. Look at that. Wow, it's full. So many. That's where they get big and plump. Oh, and here it is. Oh, big one. Wow. It's just amazing to watch here. We just took a crab from the nest. We're tying it up. We're gonna personally bring it over to one of the local seafood restaurants here and try it. And then in the afternoon, we're going for more crab. We've got a crab filled day. We're getting another. Oh, there it is. Look at that. Nice. Nice mud crab here. It's tasty. 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 Big, big meat. Big meat. Awesome. And we're going to go bring these to a restaurant. And they also have buckets full of oysters. Oyster. 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 Tasty. Oh, okay. We're just going to scale these. Oh. 0.9 kg and 1.85. So almost 2 kg for two crabs here. Thank you. Awesome. <laughs> bye bye. Bye bye. We're going right up here to Old Rest House, one of the oldest restaurants in Nagumbo for local style. We're going to get these cooked Nagumbo style mud crab. Okay, and we're going to go take a look at the kitchen. Hi. We can make Nagumbo style. Yeah, Nagumbo style. style. Spicy. Spicy. Awesome. Can spicy though? I love spicy. Yeah. This is honestly the coolest, most amazing local style kitchen in the gumbo. So we got coriander, pandan leaves, curry leaves, garlic, and onion. And then we're gonna put some curry paste, some tomato. Oh, just amazing. Oh, and here's the Ceylon. Ceylon cinnamon. 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 Oh, and cinnamon. Ceylon cinnamon. Pure gold. Pure Ceylon. Oh, and then there's cloves. It's going in. Oh, that's the base for our Nagumbo crabs. And you can really smell the pandan, the curry leaves, and the garlic. And we're gonna add those big plump crabs in. Chili. Oh, look at the color there. Wow. 
That's gonna give it so much kick. Curry powder. Oh, and tons of curry powder in there. Here come the crabs. These are our big, huge, the gumbo mud crabs. Wow. Look at those. Big, very big. Oh, and we're just gonna put some coconut milk in there. This is the most beautiful sight you'll ever lay your eyes on here. The gumbo style mud crab. You can smell that creamy coconut, that chili, that pandan leaf, those curry leaves, the onions and tomatoes, it's all in here. Oh, and we're just adding in some local spices there. Wow, it's getting so thick. That is so thick. Beautiful, plump crab claws. This is so beautiful. You are very hungry. Very hungry, yeah. I'm gonna get Wow. Look at that. <laughs> That's the most beautiful thing you'll ever set your eyes on. Wow, and just look how thick that sauce is. Comes the sauce. Wow. That is Nagumbo style sauce. Look at how thick that is. Nagumbo style. Wow. Look at that. Oh. It smells so rich and potent. Oh, wow. Thank you. Oh, look at the color here. Wow. Sri Lankan specialties. Stunning. Thank you. <laughs> Just look at the color here. We've got these Nagumbo style mud crabs. Oh, look at those plump. Massive claws, Nagumbo style. They put so much of their secret dark spice mix in at the end and these Moringa leaves. And then look at all of this beautiful selection to go with our crab. We've got the local herb, garlic and chili and all of this can go with the string hoppers here. We have a beautiful, beautiful dal, lentil dal. This can go perfectly with the string hoppers. And then we've got some local salted dried Fish. And then over here, we've got some beautiful fried cuttlefish. Beautiful papadam, fried papadam. We've got a bread fruit curry. Then we have a pole sambal, which is coconut, dried Maldives fish, chilies. Oh, and all of this can go so well with these string hoppers here. But first thing we gotta do, you know what we gotta do here. Look at this. Oh, look at how plump those claws are. Wow, covered in the gumbo sauce. Look at how dark and thick that is. Oh, there's the claw. And they covered it in moringa leaves as well. Let's just break that claw. Oh, there it is. Look at that. Oh, there's the flash. Look at that. You got to get messy with this. Let's just go right in. Mmm. Oh, that is ultra delicious. That is just like, oh, look at this. Oh, that is the best flavor you'll ever taste. Oh, look at that. Oh. Oh, that is a perfect, perfect Nagumbo crab popsicle. Oh, and you can just cover that perfect crab popsicle. You can taste the cardamom. You can taste the cloves. It's earthy, so rich. Oh. You can just break that in half. And that, just slurping that is gonna be pure heaven. Only right here in the gumbo can you taste a flavor that deep and that complex. Ah, oh, and look at all the flesh in there. And next up, we're just gonna take some dal, a little dal, a touch of that lentil dal, a bit of this breadfruit curry, just a touch. Oh, Sri Lanka, and my mouth is just on fire. As soon as you eat this, you feel the spices and you feel the love that people put into their cooking here. And we're just gonna top that off with the best, most spiciest, rich, deep, complex sauce. Mmm! There is so much complexity in everything here. That dal, so hearty. And this breadfruit curry, so smooth. And then this beautiful mud crab, so rich and you compile all those together. There really is nothing better than that. Thank you very much. That was so delicious. Very tasty. We'll see you next time. Thank you. Oh, that was just incredible, guys. And we are gonna be having so much 
crowd today. And next up, we're going for another different style of crab, the chili crab. Hi, Upalis, right here? Okay, and we are going into the kitchen now, guys. We just got permission. We're gonna order up a big lagoon crab, Sri Lankan style. Oh, this is gonna be so good. We're gonna watch how they make it. Fish head curry. Oh, fish head curry. Fish head curry. It's a huge head. Yeah, yeah. And we just threw the lagoon crab in the wok, and we're gonna fry it up in tons of chili. Oh, oh, chili paste. Oh. There we go. Look at that red. That is what dreams are made of right there. Koho Ah, good, good. Good, good. Koho Madabang. Wow. Oh, and here we go. We're going to put an egg in. Oh, that's going to thicken it up. Look at that wok full of good, plump, huge crab claws. Wow. And look at that thick chili egg paste. It's all in there. Oh, that looks delicious. Oh, crab apron. <laughs> okay. To get messy. To get messy. <laughs> this is going to be good. Oh, beautiful. Oh, look at the color. Look at this full on colorful Sri Lankan lunch we've got here. We've got chili crab cooked in Jaffna style spices. We watched them make that in the kitchen. That is so aromatic. And look at these claws. Oh, that looks beautiful. We got four beautiful crab claws there. Lagoon crab cooked in Jaffna style spices. Chili crab. And then look at this guys. Awesome, Sri Lankan mutton curry. Look at those nice chunks of mutton. And then here we have a coconut sambal. This is made with dried Maldives fish, onion, tomato. Oh, and you can really smell the fish aroma and the coconut. And then we've got a beautiful dal here. And just look at the color on this banana leaf. Oh, when you open it up there, you can just smell that potent mix of spices. We have a tapioca curry. We have an eggplant curry. We've got some cabbage leaves. Oh, gorgeous. And then more of that coconut sambal over top of rice. And he just served it with some gorgeous red rice as well. What happened next was one of the most frustrating things. Fail after fail of opening the crab claws. Let's count the fails. Just crack that beauty. Oh. Oh. oh my God. Sorry. Oh. Oh, oh, it fell. Ah, it's so slippery. I'm starting to lose it. I just gotta crack that beauty open. It's like, no, it's just awesome. oh, thank you. Okay, now I can go in. Hmm. It's all falling off. It's just all coming out like, let me take this off, it's getting too messy. And we're just gonna scoop that beautiful chili and egg combo and slurp that to get the first flavor. Mmm. Mmm. It actually tastes quite tomato-y, spicy, and a little sweet. It's definitely an intense chili, but it's a sweet, spicy chili. And after enjoying the beautiful and smooth tapioca curry and the spicy peppery mutton curry with rice, and before finishing off at night with some street crabs, we're going for one more crab on the beach in Colombo. This is it, guys. We're going for crab. Right on the beach. Oh, wow, look at that. <laughs> So this is Jaffna style? This is yeah, Sri Lankan Jaffna style. Sri Lankan spicy. Jaffna style. Oh, look at the claws on there. Wow. That is giant. Oh, look at those. Jaffna style. Oh, wow. This is the colorful lobster, sir. Colorful lobster. Yeah. It has a little bit of lime and then the roasted coconut. Wow. And we mix it with a little bit of oyster sauce as well, just to give it a little uh, sort of... Lime, yeah. coconut, and oyster yeah. sauce. Yeah. Wow, look at that. Oh, it's just bulging with flesh. So basically, you just have to uh, scoop 
squeeze some more lime juice. Squeeze some lime yeah. and go in for that. That looks beautiful. With jumbo crab. Jumbo yeah. crab. Yeah. It's giant. Look at the size of that. It's actually 1.5 kilo. 1.5 kilo. Yeah. So what sort of spices do you put in here? Uh, like a bunch of mix of Sri Lankan spices. Sri Lankan you know, spices? Yeah. yeah. Oh, turmeric, curry, 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 curry leaves, curry powder, roasted, curry powder, roasted curry powder. Oh, that is gorgeous. Oh. Oh, oh hot butter cuttlefish. Yeah. So it's like a fried cuttlefish? It's a fried cuttlefish. With butter? Yeah, well, <laughs> I have our own signature oil sauce. <laughs> yeah. Like uh, this oil that we actually make infuse it with. Wow, and, uh, that is beautiful. Well, so, and yeah. sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're gonna have to go in for this giant claw. <laughs> Look at that. Get yeah, messy. Yeah, yeah, so I can just yeah, crack it yeah, open. Yeah, and dip the, dip the bread dip inside the, the bread. Gravy. In the gravy. Oh, yeah. look at that. That's a crab popsicle. So we're just gonna take some bread and dip it into this Sri Lankan curry. Oh, look at that. Yeah, nice just get it in. saturated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, and beautiful. Get as well. And get some of that coconut yeah, yeah, sambal yeah, yeah. and put it on the bread. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh yeah, we're just gonna slide that popsicle right off. Look at that, and put it on the bread. And that's the local way. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. Use hands. Use hands. Oh. Oh, perfect combo. Mmm. Oh wow. That curry, that gravy, is absolutely perfect. It's a little peppery. You can taste the curry leaves. Oh, it's a little spicy, not too spicy. And wow, that is good. That is really good. Wow, look at that. That is beautiful. Okay. That's the hot butter cuttlefish. Mmm. Mmm. That is delicious. Spicy, crispy, buttery. Mmm, a little sweet. That is really enjoyable. Let's go for some lobster. We're gonna try this lobster. Look at that. Black coconut style. Mmm. Oh, wow. That should taste a little bit like coconut. Yeah, that's what This is original Sri Lankan. Mmm. Pure original Sri Lankan. Original Sri Lankan. Mmm. It's soft. You can't find this in any other, any other country. You can't find really? This. Just here? Oh. It tastes kind of like a, a coconut with some spicy curry. Some spicy yeah, curry. Yeah. Yeah. Curry, curry powder. powder. Curry powder. Mm, delicious. Oh, look at that. Wow. That is the ultimate claw. Mm. Oh. And to finish off the crab tour, we went for some sunset crabs and shrimp cakes at Gal Face in Colombo. Awesome guys, and we are in Gal Face here. There's all these little stalls, and we are gonna get a couple snacks, a couple local specialties, and I think right here there's a there's a little spot. Ah yeah. Okay, how are you, friend? Good, how are you? Fine, fine. Wow, look at all these specialties. The eso wada. Yeah, prawn. Oh, so we got the prawn cake. The eso wada. Wow. Yeah. Oh, we're just putting it in the oil there. Ella Kiri. Ella Kiri. Ella Kiri. That is awesome. Tasty. Yeah, sure. Oh. We're just going to cover it. That's a spicy chutney. Yeah. Oh, spicy chutney. That's beautiful. And then a little bit of onion, onion salad. Oh. So we just got the prawn cutlet. So it's a lentil, gram flour, coconut flake, and prawn cutlet. Mmm. Oh yeah. Mmm. Oh wow. Oh, that is all about the lentil gram flour patty combined with the shrimp, which are crunchy, ultra crunchy. You can actually just eat through the skin. Look at these. Mmm, yes please. Oh, and here's the crab. Beautiful. And you just covered it. Oh, so a little lime, a little chili, carrot and onion. Thank you. Oh, two. Perfect. Mmm. Oh yeah. That is beautiful. Look at that, they just cover the top 
in a lentil patty. So you've got that spicy lentil ground flour goodness with the crispness of the crab body. Oh, it's good. Mmm. Very tasty. Very tasty. Really nice. That was just amazing, guys. Sri Lanka is crab heaven. And make sure you check out our other video right down here where we visit the Ministry of Crab and have some insanely juicy and succulent crabs and prawns. Thanks so much for watching, guys.